Now here's my take on a marry me chicken recipe. And honey, you're gonna think, oh, I gotta have this. Let's get started with our marry me chicken variation. First of all, we've got about two tablespoons of olive oil and about two tablespoons of butter. And we're gonna put that on medium high heat and let that kind of melt while we're doing our thing over here. I'm using chicken tenders and there's 10 of those and I'm just gonna moisten them. And here I have about a half a cup of flour with salt and pepper that we're going to dredge them in, shake them off really good and put them in that pan of oil in just a minute. Um, we're gonna prepare a few cloves of garlic. This is a sweet onion and I just picked this beautiful bell pepper from my garden. Got three basil leaves from it. You can use dried basil if you'd rather. And at the end, I'm gonna put a handful of baby spinach for some deliciousness. And I just happen to have this in my pantry. I'm gonna try it with a few chopped artichoke hearts as well. And we'll need some heavy cream for the sauce and some Parmesan cheese. Let's get going. Now, you just take the washed or moistened chicken tenders and you dredge them in the flour and just saute them in the pan with the oil and the butter. If it gets dried now, you want to add a little bit more olive oil and just saute them until they're nice and pretty and brown, but you don't want them to get too brown because we're going to want to deglaze this pan. Here I'm adding about a cup of water and then I'm gonna add a teaspoon of chicken base. And I use that better than bouillon chicken base. And take a wooden spoon and on medium high, just get it to simmer and break up all the bits on the bottom of that pan. Oh, it's so good. And you want to pour it back out to reserve it. Now take notice, I did clean out that pan with a paper towel and got it clean. We're restarting with the butter and the olive oil. We're gonna melt that down and then add the onion and the green pepper. But hold on, don't put the garlic yet because it'll burn. Let's sweat those down a little bit, then add the garlic. And we're gonna add the reserved stock slash whatever you use, combination wine, chicken stock, chicken base. And we're gonna add a half a cup of heavy cream and we're going to add that together and it's going to look a little loose but once we put those chicken tenders back in it's going to thicken up so we want to get that back up to temperature we're going to put it on medium high probably about a level seven we want to get it back up to temperature now in the meantime i've chopped up those artichokes and the spinach so we've got them standing by and do you see how it's coming up to temperature and once it simmers, we're gonna add those uh, chicken tenders back. And we've got them, we flipped them, got them on both sides. And let's go ahead and add the artichokes and the baby spinach and get that sauteing. Doesn't that look pretty? We're gonna add some Parmesan cheese to that. And you can be very generous with that if you want to, probably up to a half a cup, to three fourths a cup of Parmesan cheese. And honey, you're gonna want to say, I gotta have it. Woo! Thank y'all so much for watching. 